channel. Thanks to all of my subbies for always joining me. And thanks to you, my new friend, for watching. All right, guys, it is wash day. And I am showing you how I wash my natural hair without tangling. That is major. But before we get into that, I want you to go ahead and hit that like button because I know you're going to love this. I want you to hit that subscribe button because I know you're going to want to come back. And of course, I want you to follow me on all of my other social media outlets so we can go ahead and keep the party going. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get into it. I'll show you how I'll be washing my hair for today and how I keep those tangled and not all wet. Okay, guys, so here it goes. This is my hair after two and a half weeks of not washing it. Just shameful. I know it's a mess. But we're going to get through this unscathed wash day underway, but this is what it looks like all matted and it is a complete mess. So the first thing that we're going to do is that we're going to separate our hair in sections because of course any wash day is not a success if you don't separate your hair. So I'm separating my hair in four sections right now. Okay, so after I've separated my hair in four sections, I'm then going to section my hair again. And I'm using my hands. I'm being very gentle with my hair. Uh, that is the tip here. You have to be very gentle, good people. You have to know that you are going to use your hands through this whole process. And basically, you're going to be pulling your strands apart gently, as you see me here. Because you can just not take that comb and put it in your hair, boo. It's just not going to go down so you're taking your beautiful hands your hands are your tools and you're just going to be separating your hair like so just gently and soft not heavy-handed so once you've taken your hair and you separate it with your hands you're going to take any kind of uh, spritzer, I'm using my DIY detangler spray. This thing is a godsend for my hair. I use it to pre-poo as well as refresh my curls. But this is a DIY spray. I'm spraying it all over my hair, being very generous with it, making sure my hair is very saturated, making sure it is also applied to the roots of my hair because that is where my hair gets I guess the most tight so I'm definitely making sure I spray that all over my hair using my hands to pull that product down and just raking it all the way through my stresses and focusing it on my ends. So I'm still using my hands and I'm raking all of the product down my hair, just smoothing it down and separating that sections. And look how my knots have actually loosened up without me even putting a comb to my hair. So I'm just using my hands. And then at that point, I'm gonna get my comb. This is where I pick up my comb, good people. Then I'll start by tackling my hair at the ends of the hair. You never wanna start at the roots of your hair. That would just be deadly so my technique here is that i'm starting at the ends of my hair and just each time i move my hair up and comb it down definitely focus it on the ends moving my hair up and then at that point i then focus the comb on my roots and just combing it down holding my ends taut and pulling the tangles down and then grabbing it again at my root and then combing it all the way down. So once I'm done with that, I then twist that hair up and get ready to move on to the other sections of my hair, repeating that same process.
Okay guys, so I'm on the last sections of my hair and I'm still using the DIY spray. I'll be sure to put a link down below and showing you how I create the spray as well as adding a card somewhere up in the video. But I just wanted to show you guys again how I detangle my ends. So as you see, I am holding my hair and then tangling my ends one section at a time, moving my hands up further as I detangle each section, holding it taut, and then moving it all the way up to the top sections of my hair, combing that part down. And then once I get to the top, I then take the comb and I comb down the tangles from my roots, holding my ends, holding the ends of my hair taut and pulling those tangles down, then holding my hair at the root again and combing it down. This process, good people, works for my hair and it prevents the knots and the tangles, especially when I go to wash my hair. Now that my hair is all sectioned off, it is all ready to be shampooed. So this is what it's going to be looking like. And this is all the shed hair that I had, which is pretty good considering. All right, guys. So I am shampooing my hair in sections, as you can see. And this is the great method for my hair. This works for me every time. So now I'm just unraveling those twists that I originally have just using my hands to rake down my hair and letting that water just flow all the way down my tresses. So I'm gonna be using a co-wash. This is the Detangling Co-Wash by Miel Organics. I love this stuff. This is a great product for co-washing. So I'm adding that product at the roots of my hair and then holding my hair taut again and working that product at the roots of my hair making sure that the product buildup is falling down the strands of my hair. Once I'm done shampooing each section of my hair, I then take my comb and I will do that same method and combing down the roots of my hair. But as you can see, it's a little easier. I'm taking that comb all the way to my roots and just detangling. My hair is really detangled and just taking that comb and just running it all the way through my tresses. My hair is now washed and then I just pin it up and voila, the hair is clean, detangled, and your girl is done. Okay guys, so I am now done washing my hair. I'm using an old t-shirt to get that excessive moisture out of there. And this is basically it. I'm showing you my hair, no product. It is all detangled, good people. I can run my hand through my tresses and the comb. <laughs> so it just this process just definitely works. Just showing you how it's easy it is to comb through my hair. And yeah, this process for me works every time. It is what I do every time I wash my hair and to get it ready for styling. Now that my hair is all clean and detangled, a sister is good and happy, <laughs> okay? I know this process can take probably about little over an hour, but it is well worth it. Your hair will thank you. Your hair will be manageable, and then you will be able to run your hair and that comb through your untangled tresses that has no knots, no nothing, okay? So go on and do that, all right? So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, ciao.